Well, if you choose to stand on a napkin in the center of the octagon and stand and trade with this young man, you're playing with fire. Frightening knockout power. Go look at the highlight reel. As good a reel as anybody in the sport, you can be sure he'll be looking to find a home for those heavy hands early and often. You do not want to get in a slugfest with this young contender, I can assure you of that. This guy has some of the best throws we have ever seen inside the octagon. The speed of his execution and the technique that he uses in the delivery are truly world class. Yes, here he is, the founder of Jeet Kune Do, and as Dana White calls him, the father of modern mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee making the walk tonight. You can make the argument no man has had as much of an influence on UFC fighters as Bruce Lee has. Quoted as saying, the best fighter is someone who can adapt to any style. Man, it would have been great to see what Bruce Lee could have done inside the UFC. He is making the walk tonight. This guy has insanely fast kicking technique. If you are within kicking range, you are in a world of trouble. And now our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. So three years the gap in age between these two fighters with similar height and reach. Now for the official introductions, the veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds of the UFC lightweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet eight inches tall, weighing in at 136 pounds. Fighting out of Manila, Philippines, the King. And now with the his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon is Mario Yamasaki. So Mario Yamasaki, your third man in the go, octagon on, here you tonight. Ready? You ready? Let's well, go, always go. great to be back in Houston, Texas. Good to have you with us tonight as we get underway with live UFC action from Toyos. Well, what a visual this is. Bruce Lee ready to go for round one, the founding father of modern mixed martial arts. It's hard to simulate his speed. And wow! This could be it right here. Oh, straight right. Now mixing one into the body. Wow. Oh! This could be it. Oh, very nice. A big shot to the head. Hard straight punch. Good defense there. How about that shin? Oh, he moves right into that uppercut, Joe. That is not a good look and not something that he can afford to do here moving forward. And he is throwing that right with fight ending intentions. Oh, he's landed some good shots here. That one appeared to stun him. Trying to find a home for that right hand. 
Tremendous kick to end the fight tonight. That might be the biggest highlight of his UFC career. He certainly didn't telegraph it, but he got full force and extension behind it, and his opponent had absolutely no chance after that weapon was thrown. A perfect land and perfect execution to get the knockout with that kick here tonight. Let's take a look at it from another angle here. This is the one that causes the knockdown and the subsequent follow-up strikes for the knockout. Look at this. Boom! And that is all she wrote. And there he is after the huge knockout turned in tonight. Near perfect execution and one of the bigger highlights of his UFC career. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is called to stop to this contest at 3 minutes, 44 seconds of the very first round. To play the winner by so just the way he drew it up here tonight, what a monumental moment and knockout to get his hand raised here tonight. He kept the judges out of it. He has certainly set himself up for a major opportunity here moving forward, but you can be sure tonight is about this knockout. He'll be celebrating deep into the night with his friends, his family, his coaches. Congratulations on a big KO tonight.